Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. My goodness, what an amazing season it has been so far. Wow, it is Christmas Eve 2023. My goodness, here we are. As we count down the moments to the wonderful, wonderful, blessed day of Christmas Day 2023, I hope that you're healthy and well watching this, and I hope you have had an amazing Christmas Eve and a wonderful Christmas season. For me here on my channel, I hope that from my heart and from my family to yours, that you have a wonderful Christmas, a wonderful time. I hope that you're blessed with amazing, magical experiences, all of what the magic of Christmas can bring. Christmas for me is my most favourite time of the year, it truly is. And this year we've had our annual Christmas Eve party with my mum, my dad, my brothers, my sister-in-law, my brother's fiancé, uh, nieces, nephew, we've had it all and it's been amazing. We've had laughs and drinks and food and singing and it's just been amazing, it really truly has. All of the wonderful things which Christmas so beautifully mirrors and so beautifully captures. And so it's been a really, really amazing time. Everybody has worked hard this year and it's just so amazing to be able to see people enjoy this Christmas season. As I always say, one of my favourite things at Christmas is just how people change, that they seem to have a bit more of a lighter step in their foot. They seem to be a little bit more forgiving, you could say, a little bit more happy. They seem to be a little bit more free in just daily life. And it's just great. It really, truly is. Christmas Eve today, as much as I always try to plan everything to be absolutely perfect from about early September, there always seems to be something which I seem to be rushing about doing on Christmas Eve. This year it was an amazing experience, getting the house ready, getting the food ready, the preparations ready for the party with my mum and for all of the family to turn up and uh, it was great and my twin brother turned up and we had to go and do a few things in at the pet store and um, he has a beautiful uh, Dalmatian uh, called Percy which we had to, uh, <laughs> he had one or two gifts which he needed to go and uh, sort out as well for him and he needed some special food and one thing or another and then he forgot something in his Christmas shopping and we forgot something so there's always something Christmas Eve in my family there really truly is but so I think that just makes the magic of Christmas Eve that no matter how perfect you try and make things that there's always a way there's God's way that actually do you know what it's perfect yes it is but this is going to happen because this is the way I granted it for you. So I was there transiting around the shops and we got what we wanted and we got home and then we got just for about half an hour's time for me to rush home, wrap the last few gifts and sign a few cards which I wanted and then we welcomed all the family in for our Christmas Eve bash as to speak. And it was lovely. I absolutely loved it. My sister-in-law, my brothers and my mum and my dad and it's just magical memories of my dear nan bless her she's no longer with me but she is in heaven and she's up above and she's watching over me and she's here always and on this christmas season my nieces and my nephew and i have two nephews sadly my nieces um my sorry my niece and my nephew i don't see uh through family difficulties and one thing or another let's be honest nobody is perfect however each family is perfect because of who we choose to spend it with around the Christmas table. But I, I don't see uh, a niece or a nephew, but they're always in my hopes and my prayers, and I love them always, forever and more. And um, this Christmas, it was lovely. I had my nieces, my uh, my twin brother's little uh, girl, my my niece, and um, and she's four, and I had one of my... Um, my second eldest brother, I had uh, his daughter and, and son here and his stepson, and that was lovely, and it really, really was. And um, my twin niece and nephew, which is who I have just spoke of, and uh, that was lovely, and we had games and laughter, and, and yeah, it was amazing. And we sung songs, and my little niece, we sung Rocket Around the Christmas Throne, All I Want for Christmas, and all different songs, and it was just lovely. And do you know what? Christmas so beautifully just captures everything. That Do you know what? This life is so, so special, and each and every single one of us, there is only one of us. And in my faith and in my heart, the good Lord created only one of us in his own image, and if you're not of faith, bear with us because you are amazing because there is only one of you in this world. And we had an amazing time. We sang, we laughed, we danced, and we had an amazing time. And I hope in your family this Christmas that you've had equally just as a special time this Christmas Eve. And I hope Christmas Day blesses you with an amazing time as well with family and loved ones and friends around the Christmas table and the Christmas tree. 
let's just take a moment and, to, and just to spare a thought for Christmas, yes, and all its magic and all its wonder is a very, very magical time. But let's take a, a, take a moment and consideration for people who are less fortunate than ourselves and who will wake up on Christmas morning with less than what we will. And you know what? Let's take a moment and let's wish them a very, very Merry Christmas and a wonderful year to come. And let's hope that there is good fortune. There is all of those wonderful things that this life has to offer and the good Lord has to offer to come for them in 2024. On that note, do you know what? It's been such an amazing Christmas season and it's been such a wonderful, wonderful evening. I just want to leave you with a simple note that, you know what, we're all amazing in our own right, that there is nobody is the same on this earth. Whoever you are, whatever you are, whatever you want to refer yourself as, or whoever, you are amazing in your own right. There is only one of you. And whether you believe in faith or not, you are gifted as a gift to this earth. And you are gifted that there is only one of you. So you're amazing in that simple fact. And if you are of faith, he's created us all in our, in his own image. And for that, we are it's just a true blessing. So on that fact, on this Christmas Eve, I wish you a very, very Merry Christmas, and I wish you good health, and I wish you all amazing, wonderful things to come in 2024, and I hope that you have a very, very happy new year, and I hope you have a very, very Merry Christmas. I've had a wonderful time with my family uh, this Christmas Eve, afternoon, early evening, into later evening. We've had all of it, fun, games, laughter, singing, all of it. Wonderful food, drinks, merriment, cheer. Let's spread that in this life. And uh, yeah, let's all hope that we have a wonderful 2024. And let's hope that we take all the love that the Lord pours into us. And let's hope that we pour that into this life. Let's continue that prosperity. Let's continue that love. Let's continue that perf that that cheer. And um, yeah, that perfection of uh, life. Let's help others. Let's love others. And let's take all of what the good Lord pours into us. Let's keep going. And if you're not of faith, as I say, then you're amazing. And let's just help us to live an amazing life and to think of ourselves that we only have a gift of today. And this was the Christmas Eve of 2023. And it was amazing. So let's run with it. Let's grasp with it because nobody's promised a tomorrow, but being it's Christmas Eve today and Christmas Day tomorrow. Hopefully, God willing, that you're blessed with an amazing, beautiful day tomorrow. So God bless you. And I hope you've had an amazing Christmas season, an amazing Christmas Eve and an amazing, wonderful Christmas day to come. God bless you. And thank you very much for joining me. And until next time, I hope you have a wonderful Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas. God bless. And I will see you in 2024. Bye for now.